Hey guys, welcome back. It's Tori, and today you're watching Tori Talking Books. Today I'm going to be talking about TBRs for the month of May. I'm really excited about this one because I have a lot of books coming up, and I've kind of talked about two of them already in the first video that I've made. But I kind of, I have a few more added to that list, and I wanted to update you guys. Also, it's the beginning of May, so now time like the present to put that in and see where it goes. Hope you guys enjoy. The first book on my TBR list for the month of May is The Queen of Nothing by Holly Black. Now I have talked about the previous two books that she wrote which was The Cruel Prince and The Wicked King and um, they were books that I really really enjoyed and I cannot wait to see where she takes this series. Next book on this list is Days of Blood and Starlight by Lainey Taylor. I read the first book a really long time ago, um, Daughters of Smoke and Bone, and I actually didn't enjoy it as much as I thought I would, so I've kind of been pushing this book off. But I do have this one and the next book in the series, which is Dreams of Gods and Monsters. and. I finally decided like now is the time I should try and see where this series goes. Um, I'm kind of surprised that I've pushed it off this long, but I will let you know how this goes and if I like it more than the first book. But that's my next on the list. The next book that I have on this list is a book that I've had on my shelf for a while now and just never got around to reading, which is surprising because it deals with a kind of genre that I'm really interested in and I've heard a lot of really good things about it um, and that is Vampire Academy by Rochelle Mead. Now I know some of you guys are going to come at me and be like, you haven't read that yet? But like, no I haven't. I have all of them, the entire series up here and I've never gotten around to reading them and I'm super disappointed because I hear so many good things about it but I that is definitely on my TBR for this month and I will let you guys know how it goes and if I like it or not because it seems like something that I'd really enjoy. The next book on this list is Matched by Ali Condi. Um, I'm really excited to read this. I've heard good things about it and bad things about it but I... Do you see that? It's like bent. Yeeks! Um, I hear it's a really good romance and it looks solid the book that I would like so we're gonna try it out see where it goes and if it doesn't I'll let you guys know but that is my next book the next book on this list is actually a book that doesn't have a lot to do with the kind of genre that I'm usually intrigued by and read a lot and that is The Alienist by Caleb Carr um I got this a while back and it was after my spree of Criminal Minds. I loved Criminal Minds and I saw this and I was like, do I hear profilers? Do I hear criminology? Like, yeah. And so I picked this up and I'm really excited to see where it goes because like I said, it's not usually something that I'd be intrigued by and pick up, but I'm definitely excited, so we will see where this goes, and I'll let you guys know how I feel about it. I think I'll like it. I hope there's some romance to chime me over though. The last book on this TBR list is a book that I'm sure everyone has heard about, and I'm sure that you've either seen the movies or read the book yourself, and I'm also kind of sad because I hear it's really sad, but that is a Dog's Purpose by W. Bruce Cameron. I have heard so many good things about this book and so many sad things about this book. I've seen the movie a long, long time ago and so I can't really remember what happens. I just remember crying a lot because, you know, if you know, you know, right? Um, but I'm really excited. I picked this up. Like I said, it's not usually something that I pick up because there's no romance. It's sad. Um, no fantasy. No superpowers. No dystopian. No nothing. But it's got a dog, you guys. Like, look at that dog. 
Am I right? I'm right. Okay, so <laughs> I will read this and let you guys know how I feel, but I'm kind of excited. I'm, I'm excited. We're gonna see how it goes, but I, I have a feeling. A feeling about this book. I think it's gonna be good. <laughs> hey guys, I'm so glad you tuned in with me today. I hope you guys enjoyed it because I certainly enjoyed making it. But um, if you guys did enjoy, please like and comment and subscribe. If you have seen one of these books and want to let me know how you felt about it, leave that down in the comments. Or if you haven't and you want to read one, let me know that too. Um, I cannot wait to read these. Please don't spoil them though because I really just want to go into them and like be surprised and have the full reading experience. But um, thank you guys and I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye!